Welcome to SEBA's online commercial core class for 2022 and 2023, the next best thing to a live lecture. My name is Bethany Kelsch. I'm a real estate attorney with FKSDO, which is an acronym for FIXO, Kretschmer, Smith, Dixon, and Ormseth. And we are a business and real estate firm located in Seattle, Washington. Uh, you may have also seen me teaching the live core classes, and I also teach SEBA's uh, leasing forms classes. If you ever have any questions about either of those two areas, please feel free to reach out. This class is designed with short video clips and quizzes, and it's designed that way so that you can take this class at your convenience. After you've taken all of the modules and taken the quizzes for each module successfully, you will get a certificate for three continuing education clock hours. So what is Commercial Core? Every two years, the Department of Licensing and the Real Estate Commission release a curriculum of mandated areas that they would like organizations like SEBA to provide clock hours credits to learn about legislative business practices and legal updates in the industry. So today's class will be focusing on the, the topics that the DOL and the Real Estate Commission would like us to cover for the 2022 and 2023 years. So on today's agenda, starting with the legislative update, it will be both a national legislative issues update and a Washington state legislative issues update. We'll also go through a legal update that includes common complaints and investigations, but that's by the DOL. Case studies and looking at how courts are, look, are examining duties of a broker and violations of those duties. And also we're gonna look at how competition in the brokerage industry is being scrutinized on a national level in the context of some class action suits in, in the Midwestern states. And we'll then sum up our class with business practice updates and professional standards including organizational structures, roles, and responsibilities, commercial real estate best practices, some re reminders on risk avoidance, and we'll touch on real estate advertising at the end of the class. Let's get started. 